Hello my dear friends, how are you all? Welcome back to my channel. So uh, today's video is uh, uh, a DIY. Uh, it's a, a creating eco-friendly coconut shell planter. And before that, a quick request, please follow my Instagram ID for more photos and you can order customized product and printing from there. Okay, so first thing first, how to crack the coconut. For this, we need a big coconut and we will mark water uh, in circular form on the top of this coconut shell. And uh, with the help of a heavy object, we will try to crack it. We will tap it at the marked uh, points only. Uh, with her patience, we have to crack it and don't crack it very hard. Otherwise, it will crack as per its own wish. So now you can see that it has been cracked at the uh, marked places only and we have to do it very gently. So now our shell has been cracked and with the help of a knife, I am trying to uh, take out all the water from the coconut shell. So let's take out the brick cover and you can see here and that uh, our coconut shell has been cracked in the circular form where we have marked the water and uh, there are little sharp edges which we need to clear and yes the second step is how to clean inside first uh, i took out all the coconut from the inside with the help of a knife and there are little coconut uh, parts are there inside so uh, i'm going to keep it uh, uh, in the sunlight for five to six hours so that whatever uh, leftover part is there inside it will uh, get dry and with the help of any sharp object I'm trying to take out all these uh, uh, leftover part of coconut I will scrape it and will try to take it out Uh, once it is done, as we are making a, a coconut shell planter, uh, for that we need to make a hole under it so that water should not stay inside the shell. Here I am taking a sharp object and trying to make a hole in the eye of this shell. So next step is how to clean the outside. Uh, in the outside of this cover, there are many excess uh, uh, coconut uh, cover is there, uh, which we need to take out so that a uh, plain surface will be created for our painting. For that, here I am using a knife and scraping all the excess uh, cover. And uh, while doing this process, be careful for your hand. So now you can see our shell is almost ready uh, but uh, uh, there are some uh, extra particles there inside this shell so with the help of sandpaper we will scrape it and whatever teeny tiny uh, extra part is there we will take out so that our surface will be very uh, smooth 
so uh, and we can start painting on it Now the next step is how to paint on it. Once our surface is ready, uh, then first I have drawn uh, uh, my uh, drawing with the help of a pencil and now I am filling the color. Here I am making a bunny picture who is sleeping and always use acrylic color acrylic colors are waterproof so that it will stay on your surface so here i'm uh, first uh, making the, the ear of this bunny and uh, uh, this bunny is sleeping in this picture So now, once our painting is done, to highlight the border, here I am using this CD DVD marker pen uh, to highlight the border and please remember always go for permanent marker so that when it will come across with water, water should not hamper your painting. Here I am taking the deep green color and light green color in the tip of this brush and making this the leaf so that there will be a shade effect on the leaf. And yes, our rock planter is ready. We can see these uh, beautiful uh, leaves and flowers in the back side. I have drawn this uh, purple colored flower. And uh, you can see your painting with Asian paints uh, varnish. And uh, yes, please uh, uh, select a permanent marker so that uh, while applying varnish, it will not spoil your uh, uh, border. And uh, yes, that's it for today. I hope you have liked it and if you have liked it then please subscribe, share and like it. Thank you and also comment. Thank you so much. Take care.